Hey, what's up everybody? So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use something called Node Version Manager to control which version of Node you're using at any given time. So it looks like this. You can use NVM LS. I'll make this a little bit bigger. And it'll show you which version you're currently using and which other versions you have installed on your machine. To get a list of all the commands, you use NVM H and it gives you this list of all the different things that you can do. You can see it has the command on the left and then the description of what it does on the right. So the important ones we're going to use once we get NVM installed is NVM install and then the version number of node that you want to use which will actually use that version by default or if you're switching back and forth you can use NVM use to switch to a different version and then the other important one is setting a default alias that way your shell remembers which version you're wanting to use and by shell I mean terminal so if you open up a new terminal window you're still using the same version that you were using previously so there's a bunch of other ones but I'll let you guys go through those on your own so here it is on github github.com slash creation ix slash nvm and we'll scroll down to the installation they have an install script um, if you have curl that's what I'm going to use. Um, it should be installed by default, I think, with Mac. If it's not, you'll have to go look up curl. Uh, if you're using a Linux machine, you'll probably want to use the wget command. But So we'll use the curl command. You just paste it into your terminal. And it's going to install it. OK, so once it's done installing, then you can use nvmls like I did before. And that will show you that it's installed. So if you want to use the latest version of Node, for instance, you can go to the Node.js website, nodejs.org, and you can see that the most current version is 9.11.1 with the latest features, or recommended for most users is 8.11.1, which seems to be a more stable version. Since I don't have 8.11.1, I'll go ahead and show you how to install that. So, because I'm already currently using the latest version. So, nvm install 8.11.1. And it says now using node version 8.11.1. So, if we do the nvm ls again, you can see that here in green it's 8.11.1. And if I do nvm h, I can see that nvm alias default. Uh, node command so I will make this a little bit easier to read so I'm going to take this right here paste it in and change it to 8.11.1 uh, so when you do that nvm alias default 8.11.1 now when I open a new terminal it's going to be using that same version so I actually want to switch back to the version I was using so I can see which versions I have with nvm ls there's version 9.11.1, so I'll say nvm use 9.11.1, and then I'll do nvm alias default 9.11.1, so it defaults to that version in the future. Okay, so that's it. And if you don't have curl, then you can look it up here. It's the first one. And there should be, and let's see here, download. Yep, you can download this uh, tar file or a zip file, and then you just unzip it and install it. Um, once you have it installed, you may have to restart your um, terminal, and then you can go back and you can try running this command. And then, of course, if you're using Linux, you can use the wget command. Okay, uh, so that is it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and we'll see you in the next video.